IBM just introduced the most powerful quantum computer chip ever, twice more as powerful as the previous best, at, which was 216 qubits. They have now a 433 qubit Osprey chip. And they have a new quantum system too, which will be able to scale to 8,000 qubits. And we'll have several of those work together to get to 16,000 qubits. That system is, the quantum system two was described in this next section from IBM. Quantum System 2 isn't just a standalone system. It was designed to be extensible, supporting up to 4,158 qubits with additional control racks added. It was also designed to be modular, so multiple Quantum System 2s can connect cryostats with long-range couplers connecting the processors, supporting up to 8,316 qubits, and with three System 2s, a remarkable 16,632 qubits. In a data center environment, Classical or AI racks can be swapped out to extend the computational capacity of the system. These powerful new quantum chips from IBM, and then one that will follow up, that will get to thousands of qubits, will enable IBM to perhaps get to something called quantum supremacy, where quantum computers are faster than supercomputers. You can only use these systems where the supercomputer exaflops are insufficient for a very, very complex problem. The algorithms for such systems will soon be proven, and we'll, we'll see over the next few years if IBM is able to scale to thousands of qubits, maybe tens of thousands of qubits, and then to be able to use those systems to actually solve larger problems that currently are able to solve with regular computers. Please um, like and subscribe to this video and subscribe to Next Week Future on Patreon. Thanks.